Hello Internet, welcome to the Collective Arcana, a channel all about tabletop gaming. So if you're watching this, that means we are either on our way or have already watched the live show in Austin. Um, it's our first live show. We're so excited to see Critical Role um, in person. So I've been hanging on to these two minis till this week, just for my own hype. <laughs> so I wanted to work on them the week of the show to tide me over <laughs> to get me through the work week. Um, so Terry's done and make sure you check that video out if you haven't already. Um, and you know, the Doty video, honestly, this is going to be short because he's super simple. Probably the most simple uh, mini in the Vox Machina group besides maybe Trinket. So this is a good one to start with if you haven't uh, started painting yet. I mostly just want to talk about the colors really fast and give you a little guidance on that. Um, you can paint him either gold or silver and it will be accurate. There are several versions of Doty, so um, I went with gold because I thought it would contrast Terry's armor better. And, you know, they go together, so I just, I wanted that sort of opposite thing just so that they would each stand out. And then I went ahead and did the trim in silver, but I actually think it looked better before I put the trim in silver. So it's kind of, um, you have to decide if you want to you know, break up the colors or if you just want to do the one color but make the detail stand out more. So, um, I really don't think you can mess this one up. So for the backpack, I just did, you know, simple leather backpack, which I've covered in how to paint leather in previous videos. But, uh, for his bedroll, I kind of thought that Terry would want to match, right? Like he'd want his his armor to match Dodie, his little robot, right? So I did a blue bedroll and then uh, the teal or the light turquoise color journal so that they look like they go together. And uh, just to emphasize his, <laughs> his sort of personality. The only real tip I have for uh, this mini is to make sure you don't miss the gears. So he's got a couple of gears that are noticeable and some that are not so noticeable. So he's got uh, some in his hips. He's got them in the back of his knees. Let's see if I can zoom in here. So he's got them in the back of his knees and then he's got some in his elbows and he's even got some kind of, I don't know if you can see here, but it's sort of like back here in his neck. Um, and then I think he's got some in the joints of his fingers. I went ahead and just did a stripe of silver just to um, make it look like that, even if that wasn't the intention, uh, but just the, the knuckles. So with that, just paint him silver and do a black ink wash and you're done. So I hope your, your Doty came out good. Um, I'm sure he did. He's, he's a really great, fun little mini to start the, the series off with. Um, Terry, on the other hand, probably the most detailed, so, you know, <laughs> you got both extremes here. Make sure you check out the rest of the Vox Machina mini tutorial videos I've done. Some of them are just tips and tricks, and some of them are a little bit longer, just depending on the mini. And hopefully I'll have uh, the rest of the Mighty Nine done soon. I've, I've gotten started on those guys too. So if you like these kinds of videos, please give me a like, a subscribe, and uh, I hope I'll see you next time.